Now then, welcome back to another episode of Survival Series. Ark Survival Evolved. And today, I, I'm here over at our new West Coast base, the Arch of Awesomeness. We arrived in through this side. Wolfie has put up a load of stone walls to keep us protected. We've got all of our trikes all corralled up here. And little hero over here. We need another one of those. Uh, but this is where we're building right now and sorting all our stuff out. Ready for some big brontos to come through here and be like a, a parking zone. So they'll park nose to tail along here. The caravan will just pull in. And then we've got a little workshop and stuff all sorted out and ready. Everything seems pretty good right now. I've put all the packy pack up here. I've got my uh, bodyguards over here. They are awesome. Loving my carnos. They are so awesome. And I'm just heading down to the beach right now. I've been collecting for hours. Collecting stuff and things and berries and bits and pieces. They're probably all spoiled by now, but I've been collecting them anyway. And that's a cool thing. I like that. Uh, let's get some water. Let's fill the water skins i got three water skins because I want to do some painting today. I want to test out painting and see how that is. But uh, while I'm here, can I just kill you? You're just going to go back in the water. Get out of here. You're not going anywhere, are you? Yes, I got him. <laughs> I, I killed him. I killed him. Dang it. I killed him. I thought the Trank Arrows were supposed to trank him, but no, we killed him. Oh, well. Well, we got some oil anyway. Uh, I don't think I need oil for paint, though. I'm pretty sure I'm okay without oil for paint, but still. We'll do that. And uh, while I'm here, let's just gather a few more berries. I'm gathering stone. There's loads of loose pebbles on the beach. I don't want to be gathering stone. I want to be gathering some berries... Uh, I've got loads already, but I just want to make sure I get some more. I may as well get some fibre while I'm here as well. Uh, trying to get everything sorted for this episode has been rather strange because Wolf is not here. So I'm not sure exactly what I'm supposed to be doing all the time. Uh, I'm going to come inside here though and get this sorted out if I can. Okay, so uh, painting. First of all, I'm going to need some paint. And let's see if I've got enough berries. I've got these things. Oh, actually, first things first. I've got these recipes that work in the pot. And I thought about making a quick um, a quick bookshelf for them. So let's get into the wood shack. This is all our wood supplies. And grab some wood. And see about crafting a shelf. There we go. Got one. Craft it. Thank you. And it's done. Yeah, okay. Uh, there's a bookshelf. I wanted to test out a bookshelf in here to see where it would fit and see what it would look like. Wolfie's built this wonderful, wonderful place and I was just wondering how uh, a bookshelf would fit in. Uh, we can't put it up. We can't have it up in the air. Can we have it down the corner here? Maybe if that fire wasn't there. The fire's fairly useful there, but maybe if I can just demolish this one and put it somewhere slightly different. Let's take all this out. There we go. So now, will the bookcase go here? Yes, it will. Okay. So if I put the bookcase next to the wall here, there is as close as we're going to get. There we go. Put a bookcase next to this thing. These cooking pots will allow us to do uh, making of dyes and things. Let's have a look in here now. Access... And do these things just slot in there? Yes, they do. Does anything else slot in there? No. Only these recipe things. Which is good. Okay. And there we go. So these are recipes for bits and pieces. There's a mind wipe recipe. There's medicine. There's soup. And a stew. And that's medicine again. So we've got, uh, we've got medicine available to us as well. Which would be quite cool. Two handful, handfuls of trito berries. That's those things. Uh, so two of those. A dollop of narcotic, which I've got over here. I am doing painting, but a uh, dollop of narcotic. Let's take a stack of narcotics. 
and let's see if we can make this actually work. <laughs> let's see if we can make some for a start. Okay, so a couple of those. A uh, bit of that. And light the fire. Put the water in. It should be full. Oh, it's, it's not using a full one, is it? Let's put two in. See if it'll do that. See if it'll craft it. I don't know if it'll craft it because it needs a full water. But uh, I don't even know if it's actually working or not right now. I don't know. I don't know if it's actually doing what it's supposed to do or not. Uh, I just pooped. It is making charcoal and using things and doing stuff, but is it doing it right? I don't know. Let's put some more tinterberries in there. Uh, let's have a look, see if I've got some more in here. Yes, I do. Let's have some more of those. And put those in it. And see if that's going to make any difference whatsoever. Let's put those in there. Uh, I guess it's just a case of waiting. I mean, the, the other things, when you're crafting stuff on other things, this, this forge here... You just light it and it starts making the metal into ingots using thatch to burn. That's easy enough done. And over here... There it is! Yeah! Yeah! It's, it's, oh, it's doing red colouring, actually. That's not quite what I was after. That is... Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, it's making red dye, not narcotics. Okay, so let's put the fire out. The red dye is cool, though. I've got red dye now. That's good. I like that. I need some more water again now, though. I've just got to remember not to put the water in my hot bar because then it uses the water. That might be the key ingredient there, is to uh, use the water from down here. So I, I take water, and then that fills up, that fills up, and then I move that into there, and that into there. And I'll use this one. And I'll just refill that one on my hotbar. Okay, let's try that. Because <clears throat> I think I was drinking a little bit out of each water skin when I was wandering around here. It was keeping me hydrated by letting me use some water out of each water skin. Which is a bit odd, I know. But still, let's see now. Okay, so we've got some red dye. Let's take that out. So it was Tinterberry and Narcotic, wasn't it? Uh, let's... Tinterberry... And half dollops of narcotic submerged in water cook in a cooking pot. Yes. Do they mean narco berries? Mm-hmm. Let's see. Because the, the recipe system and crafting in this is not so easy. So where did I put those water skins? Let's put a full water skin in there. That looks full. And light the fire. And see what it cooks up. Put some more wood on the fire as well. I'll leave the charcoal in there because I'll need that in a bit. But hopefully this will now create me a healing potion. No. More red berries. Mm, well, more red is okay. I guess more red is okay. There we go. 15 more red. <laughs> okay, not quite what I wanted. Let's, uh, let's put out the fire again. I'll try and make that again later. At least I'm making the dyes. At least that's something. At least that's something. Let's put the, the narc stuff back in there. Making drank arrows and lots of narc as much as possible over here in the pedestal. Pedestals. Uh, ready to create us some taming of creatures. Uh, I'm going to create one more there. I'll keep doing that though. And what do I need for this then? I want to get some purple. So I've got some red. So I can paint the town red. I've got some blue there. And oil. I don't know why I want oil. But I've got it on me now anyway. Let's have a look in the inventory here. Put out the fire a second. Okay. So if I take um, nine blue. Uh, nine. Nine blue and nine red. Nine blue, nine red. And some spark powder. Hmm. Do I have any spark powder created yet? I don't know that we've got any spark powder created yet. Uh, spark powder is flint and stone. 
I have some flint and stone. Let's get some flint and stone. Uh, Wolfie might already have made some and put them on uh, one of these trikes somewhere. But let's see. Uh, see about getting some for myself. Doing things my way. Let's see if little Sarah's got anything on her. Uh, flint, yes. And I've got some stone. Okay. That's good. Let's check this out. <laughs> I love the crafting system, but I just wish there was something to, like, select what exactly you were trying to make in this. Uh, because just throwing stuff in is pretty hard work. I mean, this one, when you get into here, this is pretty good because it allows you to see what you're crafting, in a way. So, there you go, look. So it shows you what you want to craft. So I then craft the item. Uh, let's just craft ten. Why not? I think I need a few more anyway. I need one for each purple uh, magenta die, should I say. Let's do that. There we go. Alrighty. And access inventory. Okay, so let's put uh, one spark powder in there and light the fire. Now let's see if this time we get magenta die. Magenta. Come on. Bring me, bring me magenta. And then the other way of doing it is purple make it is red and blue with charcoal i believe so that should be the next thing that i can do i get some more blueberries while i'm waiting here uh there we go get some more of those been doing lots of resource gathering let's have a look magenta i need water don't i yeah let's put the water in uh no that's empty there's the full one there's a the full one is it full enough or have I uh, used a little bit out of it? Hmm. I've only got nine of each in. Oh, yeah, it's done it. Yeah, magenta dye. Awesome. Okay, so that's good enough for now. Right, that's it for now. Putting the water in and out of it is a bit of a pain, isn't it, right? But we've got these two now. Now what I need to make is a paintbrush. And a paintbrush is going to cost me one wood and three hide. So uh, let's go get some wood and hide, make ourselves a paintbrush and see how we do it. That's as much as I know. So I'm hoping that we kind of just dye the brush. Uh, we got some, uh, we got fibres in there, got wood in here. Let's take one wood out and that stone in that one. Uh, have, I, have I got fibres yet? I don't know if I had enough stuff there. Let me see. Paint. Uh, so I'm still short. Three hide. Oh yeah, hide. That was it. Hide in here. Uh, no. Oh, hide's in the main building. Uh, da, da, da. I've got stuff all over the place. I've been storing stuff. These cupboards don't really have enough space in them either. Uh, three hide. Okay, did I have that? Yes. Okay, craftable paint. Yes, now I can do a paintbrush. Okay, craft the item. Awesome. And what do I need for that? One hide. Let's get one hide. And two wood. That's cool. Let's have a look, see if I can get some wood out of here quickly. One, two. Yeah. Craftables. Uh, craftables, craftables, craftables. Where's the paint? Paint canvas. Okay, I'm going to craft one of those as well, just because I can. Alright, so now we've got the paintbrush. So how do I do the paintbrushy thing? Uh, let's get the canvas and put the canvas on the wall, I guess. Uh, let's put it on the wall here. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. I got a painting canvas. Awesome. That's a new one on me. Uh, not really done painting in the game before. And there's my paintbrush. Let's see. Can I put... Oh, I can put stuff on it. Awesome. So, can I put some paint on that and then use the paintbrush on things? What can I use the paintbrush on? Nothing special. Um, I could dye full suits of armor by the looks of that, though. Let's have a look. Magenta pants. Oh, I get to put them on separate bits here. Okay. Color region one. And color region six or five. Let's go color region one. Dye the item. Okay. I can dye my pants. Cool. Awesome. And this one. And that one. What's that one done? Oh, it's done those little bits around my legs there. 
Uh, yeah, I kind of like that though, but let's do that. Die. Okay. And close. So now I've got dyed pants. Awesome. See, so you can use the dye to dye your own clothing, which is pretty cool. Uh, let's do that. Okay, there's plenty of colour regions here. This one should be purple. We'll dye that. Region 2. Region 2 is that. Yes, I want that one dyed as well. Region 3. Let's see what red it is. Uh, not bothered about that bit. That one yet. There we go. Dye that. And region 6. Close. That's not bad, is it? That's not bad at all. I quite like that. And I've also got the gloves that I can do. <laughs> but, 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 but. I want to test out the painting side of things. So let's go select 6. Um, can I... Oh, okay. I can colour the whole thing. Or the outside edge there. There. What? Um, left mouse to paint. Shift left mouse to thick paint. Control right button to erase. Ah, oh, okay. Okay, let's... Let's go with... <laughs> awesome! Okay, let's, uh, let's erase. So it's almost like a paint program, which is pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, so let's put... Um, oh, this is horrid though. I can't really draw even with a paint program. Let's just put a great big N. That's good enough. At least I can spell. I can get a letter in there. I'm kind of using the dye up from the brush it seems. Uh, yeah. And you can do flags this way as well apparently. But I'm not trying to flag out yet. This is, this is super difficult this is from paint programs you know i don't use paint programs very much i do make my own thumbnails but that's about as close as it gets um yeah and i'm guessing that because of this i could also like take a section off there and take a little bit off there and just round it out a little bit and that kind of stuff just to smooth it off yeah okay 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 well enough of that Enough of that. You can't zoom in or anything, can you? <laughs> Enough of that, then. Right. Oh, you can move it around a bit as well. Cool. All right. Uh, let's save the paint. And paint name is Nemson. <laughs> Set. There we go. And escape. And there it is. I'm going to have to use my torch now, though. Oh, you can't really see it in the light. Oh, you can? Yeah, look. I put an N for Nemson on there. Awesome. Uh, right, I'm going to wait until daylight, and then I'm going to test out the painting on the creatures. I want to paint up my uh, saddles and things as well, see what we can do with that. Oh, wow. That is some striking colour scheme you've got there, Rocky. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, let's, let's do it again. Um, I don't seem to have the other side, though. How do I get to the other side of him? Um, um, okay. Seems to just be the one side I get to paint. That can't be right, can it? That can't be right. No, there must be something something odd about that. Let's, uh, let's see about this then. So we've got red on there at the minute. Let's do some more red over the belly area. So I'll just colour it in around here. Oh, wow. That really does paint in there, doesn't it? Okay, that's a lot of paint in there. Let's do the underbelly and the arms all red then. <laughs> it's going to look a right mess. I wanted to test it out on Rocky first. But the actual being able to uh, like manipulate the paint is pretty hard. Hard work, as it were. So let's go like this and just sort of give him some colour scheme around the outside. Almost similar to what he's got already. And then can we put some of that on it? And blow around the edges here. Make him all very, very colourful. Oh, yeah. Check it out. Check it out, dude. Nice. Okay. And we've got a little bit around here. There we go. A little bit around here. And down his leg slightly. Yeah, there we go. I wish I could turn him round, though. How can I not... How come I can't turn him round? I was expecting to be able to turn him round. But no. That doesn't work. Okay. I don't know why I can't turn him round. Maybe I need to stand on the other side of him. Maybe that's a thing. 
but we've got a little bit of a paint job here. Let's do some more of that. Uh, let's put some more red on the brush. I could probably use the red that I've got better first, but still. Let's just see what we can come up with here and make a make a bit of an impression on the boy. Rocky. Here we go. Yeah, down the back here. Down his toes. And plenty more on there. Underneath that bit there. That's it. Okay. And a little strikey colour across his tail. Let's have a look. Oh my days, doesn't he look bright and wonderful? All things bright and beautiful. It's rocky. If I do it from this side... No, I'm still on the same side there. How do I rotate him? How do I rotate him? Am I just going to end up with the one-sided section? Um, save paint... Uh, Rocky. Save it as Rocky. Set. I don't know why. Let's see. Okay. But I can't do the other side. Why can't I do the second side of him? What's, uh, what's occurring? How come I, I, I've painted down there? Look. Um, there must be a way I can manipulate the, the thing to scroll around or move about a bit. Oh, just, I just erased some of my work now as well because of that. Because of trying to right click on it. Mm, there must be keys or something that I can use. Let's have a look. Uh, no. Arrow keys. No. I'm going to have to look into the controls for that. But at least we're getting somewhere. At least we're getting somewhere. We're having a go. I've messed him right up though, haven't I really? Uh, the, it does look cool on blood red going down there though. That's pretty good. Blood red. And that is a very bright purple. Very bright purple indeed. We shall see how that works. We shall see how it works. While I've still got some bread on the uh, red on the brush, let's give uh, Mrs. T a little bit of a, a mouth wash. And over here, can I can I scroll you over here, please? Thank you. I can't turn it round though. Is that a thing? Is that a feature, or is it just me? Let's put a little bit of blood round the teeth here, so she keeps keeps looking blooded all the time. There we go. That's it, down here a little bit, there we go. Alright, and a little bit down here. There we go, alright. Just the blood dribbling down her chin. Down, the yes, you like it Mrs. T, you like it. You like it like that, awesome. When I can figure out how to do both sides, then that'll be epic. Uh, let's see, can I do a wall? Can I paint the town red? Can I? I can. I can change the full regions or that. So I can change the full region, yes. Die item. Make the wall red. Painting the down red. Mm -hmm. Interesting enough, but that is all I've got time for this episode. Oh my days. Uh, let's go over here and take a look at us. Oh my days. I think that might be uh, like a thumbnail type view today. Alright, thank you very, very much for watching another episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh man uh, another episode on the iron mind server playing arc survival evolved i will see you next time for some more